Welcome to the Quarto Journal, and for our very first episode, we decided to do a decorate with us since Christmas is around the corner, and we would also like to share with you our DIY and also the decors we used in this video. So stay tuned! For the past two years, we have been doing this very simple, iconic, and space-saving Christmas tree easel. So here is our step-by-step -step process. So you're going to need a twist tie, as well as a garland which we got from day to day. And starting at the very top, you have to use the twist tie to keep it in place and work your way down in a zigzag pattern to create the triangle shape of the Christmas tree. As you work your way down, make sure to really make it compressed to achieve the fuller look. So next step is to add the Christmas lights which we got from Daiso and just slowly work your way down following the shape of the garland. We also got this crystal garland from Home Center and just placed it as an S-shaped pattern. These candle lights are actually given by a friend, so just place them randomly but make sure it is evenly distributed. So we got these neutral colored sparkly ribbons from Daiso. So just like the candle lights, place them randomly. Next are these super cute Christmas ball ornaments from Daiso. We also added these wooden ornaments from Home Center. So 
So here is the final look. Who could ever imagine that from a simple easel, we achieved this very unique and beautiful Christmas tree. This is very applicable for people like us who live in small houses or apartments since you can achieve this space-saving one with just twist ties, garlands, and a bunch of ornaments. It's lunch break time, and mom and I decided to make one of our favorite meals, ramyun. So here are the ingredients and the process of making it. In our channel, we also post cooking videos, so stay tuned for that. So to continue our decoration part, this vase is an existing decor of ours but we spice things up by adding this cypress plant from Ace Hardware, this white Santa from Home Center, as well as this scented candle from Bath & Body Works. This nativity has been with us for a few years now and we just added the crystal garland and lights to make it more beautiful and also added this candle holder, reed diffuser, and accents for this corner. In our coffee table, we added this wreath from day to day, Christmas lights from Daiso, as well as statement pieces like this Christmas tree and acrylic reindeer from Home Center. We also added these recycled, branded perfume bottles on each side of the wreath. And also added these cute wooden houses from Kari 4. We also wanted to decorate this wall separating the kitchen and the living room with this garland from Daiso and we used these wall hooks as well as the help of the twist ties to attach it to the wall make sure to fluff them out to make it look fuller And just like the Christmas tree, we added these Christmas lights from Daiso. We also got this gold poinsettias from Daiso. So we got these white ribbons from Daiso because mom wanted to create a white bow to contrast with the garland.
to top it all off, we added this Merry Christmas sign from Daiso. So this concludes our very first episode. I hope you learned a thing or two from us. Please support our channel by liking this video and subscribing down below. We will post more fun videos about our family, lifestyle, food, and travel. See you on the next episode. Bye!